The uname command is a simple yet very powerful tool that prints information about a Linux machine's operating system and hardware platform. So uname has a number of flags and options you can give it to print out certain pieces of system information, but if you run uname without any flags or options, it prints the kernel name, so the name of your kernel. For example, I'm using a standard Linux kernel, so I get Linux as the output. Now, for most people, that's probably not all that interesting, because if you're on a Linux system, you probably already know you're using the Linux kernel, right? Typically, what I want is I want the version of the kernel I'm on, the release number of the kernel and you can get that with uname dash r for kernel release and now I know I'm on 6.15.4-arch2-1. If you want the kernel name and the release all in one command, you could do uname-s, which is a flag to print Linux, right? So it'll print the kernel name, and then dash r also for the release number, and if I do that, now I get Linux 6.15.4. If you want all the available system information that uname can print, do uname-a for all, and you can see I get the kernel name, I get the host name of the computer, the version number, and some other information, including the architecture, system architecture, and our operating system, in this case, GNU slash Linux. I've already shown you the flags to get the kernel name and the kernel version, but you could pick out other things. For example, dash M will print the machine architecture. You can see it's x86 underscore 64, right? And if I wanted to, I could give it the dash N flag. This is the uh, node name or the network node host name. Basically, it's the host name of the computer. So dash N for the host name and if you wanted the operating system dash o for operating system will print out in my case gnu slash linux so that's most of the flags and options with uname if you want to learn a little more about uname you can type man uname in the terminal to read the man page